Most people think AI movies fail because the tools aren't good enough. But that's not the real problem. The real reason AI movies fall apart is how those tools are used. People jump straight into animation without a plan. They generate shots one by one. And then they wonder why the character changes in every scene. So in this video, I'm going to show you a complete system to turn a single image into a fully cinematic AI movie with perfect character consistency, controlled camera angles, and clean animation. I'll also show you the exact mistakes that ruin AI movies and more importantly, how to avoid them completely. If you want to make a perfect AI movie and earn money from it, make sure to hit the like button and subscribe for more amazing tutorials. Also comment link to get all the links and prompts used in this video, our team will send them to you personally. Most AI movies fail because of the following reasons. Inconsistency in characters. Clothing changes unnecessarily. No proper storyboard. Each shot feels disconnected. If you don't define your character clearly at the beginning, the AI will guess, and guessing leads to inconsistency. That is why the first image becomes the most important foundation of your AI movie. To generate this first image, the perfect model we can use is Nano Banana Pro. But using it inside Gemini feels boring because even if we mention generating a 16 by 9 image, it often produces 1 by 1 images. So I use a tool called OpenArt because it allows me to switch between multiple models and generate images in any aspect ratio. It also helps me complete the entire movie using a single tool. If you want to try it, you can find the link in the description below. Or, if you want to use Nano Banana Pro completely free and unlimited, you can watch a video that I recently uploaded to this channel. Under the image section, click on Create Image. You will be redirected to this page. Now click on this small button to switch models. There are almost every model available to choose from. I am going with Nano Banana Pro. Next, paste your custom character building prompt. Comment link to get all the prompts that I used in this video. Now scroll down and choose the aspect ratio. If you are making an AI movie, the aspect ratio should be 16 by 9. Then choose the resolution and click on Create. This gives you your first image. Before moving to the next part, make sure your image clearly shows the following. The full face of the main character, the hairstyle, the clothing, the character will wear throughout the story, clear lighting, no extreme angles. If your image crops the face, hides the clothing, shows only a side profile, then the AI will not fully understand your character and consistency will break later. So always start with a clean, clear, front-facing character image. Once we have a strong starting image, the next step is to turn that single image into either a storyboard or a set of multiple camera angles, depending on what you want to create. Now open OpenArt again and upload the starting image we just generated into the Omni reference field. Then paste this customizable prompt and ask it to create a 3x3 grid showing a storyboard. From there, you describe the story you want to tell. If you want even more control, you can specify what should happen in each individual image of the grid. Make sure to describe each image clearly. Since it is a 3x3 layout, you can generate up to 9 scenes at once. If you do not want a full storyboard, and instead just want multiple camera angles of your character, you can simply copy the first part of the prompt, paste it into the prompt box, and add the words different camera angles. Nano Banana Pro will then generate a 3x3 grid showing your character from various cinematic angles. If you try to generate images one by one, the character slowly changes and leads to inconsistency. But when you generate all angles at once in a single grid, the AI keeps everything consistent across all of the images. To create an AI movie, we need multiple scenes with the same character, right? So instead of generating only camera angles, we generate another 3x3 grid, but this time based on a story. Each square becomes one moment in the story. Paste the same reference image again and ask the AI to generate a storyboard of a woman going to a store, buying coffee, and then returning to a forest to drink it. After that, make sure you selected 16 to 9 ratio and click Create. The generated image shows a clear and coherent story. Each frame flows naturally from the previous one, showing the woman leaving the field, entering the store, purchasing coffee, returning, and finally drinking it. This is exactly what a proper storyboard should look like. You can create any storyboard you want for your AI movie using this same method. Now let's talk about turning this storyboard into a video. I will also show you how to extend this process to create videos of any length while maintaining full character consistency. So stay with me. One easy technique you can use is using VEO 3.1. Open OpenArt and navigate to the video section, then choose image to video. Upload the 3x3 image you just generated, then choose VEO 3 from the model list. Paste the prompt that asks the AI to animate the image according to your storyboard. 
then choose the resolution. You can go with 720 or 1080. Next, choose the aspect ratio, video mode, and duration. After that, click Create. I tried this a few times, and this is the best result I got. The AI animates all the images inside a single frame. There are still some glitches, but if you try multiple times, you can get a more accurate result. After that, you can separate each scene by cropping the video to each frame and then join everything together using an editing app but I prefer to use another method that gives us enough control over individual shots. If you want real director level control, the better approach is to split the storyboard into individual images. You can either crop each frame separately and upscale it using the OpenArt Image Upscale tool, or you can upload the storyboard image to OpenArt and paste a prompt that separates the image into individual frames and enlarges them. This method is easier but consumes more credits. Repeat this process for the second image, third image, and so on until every storyboard frame exists as a full screen image. Once all the images are ready, you can animate them one by one using a high quality video model. For this example, I am using the Minimax Halo 2.3 video model. Choose the model, upload the first frame, and paste your scene prompt. You can use help from ChatGPT to create detailed prompts for each scene. Now, using open art, you can also easily add background audio and voice for the character if needed. Needed. Then choose the quality mode, duration, and resolution, and finally click Create. The result is a smooth and believable video with subtle movement that feels far more professional than the shortcut method. This is the workflow I personally use to create higher quality AI videos and storyboards. Now just repeat these steps for all the other images, then join everything together inside an editing software, and you'll have a complete AI movie. Some days don't need a plan, just a quiet start. Yeah, this was worth the walk. Before I show you how to extend this into a longer video, let me quickly show you something interesting. You know, we're always exploring amazing AI tools like image and video generators, but have you ever thought about actually making money with the content you create? Here's a super simple way to monetize your AI-generated photos, videos, or any type of content. It's a platform called DFans, and the best part is it handles most of the hard work for you. Instead of spending hours chatting, promoting, and selling manually, DFans gives you an AI chat assistant that talks with your fans, promotes your work, and even sells your content while you sleep. Pretty wild, right? So let me quickly show you how it works. Once you click the link in the description, you'll land on the DFans dashboard. Just hit the Become a Creator button, and you can sign up in seconds using your email or Google account. After that, you'll set up your profile with a photo, a display name, and a short bio location, and finally click Save. Remember, this is what your fans will see. Next, you can create your own subscription tier. For example, you might offer AI artwork packs, behind-the-scenes prompts, or custom edits. Set your price, add some perks, and even create a promo bundle with a discount to attract new subscribers. Now here's the game changer, the AI chatbot companion. With just a few clicks, you create an AI version of yourself that automatically chats with fans, builds engagement, and sells your content directly. You simply upload your images, videos, or any files you want to sell, set the price, and the AI does the rest. You can even customize the chatbot prompt. For example, if a photo shows you in a red dress, it could say, would you like to feel the texture of this red dress? This makes the chat feel real and personal. From there, everything is managed in one place. Your posts, your fan messages, your sales, and even your earnings in crypto like USDT or ETH. It's super beginner friendly and saves you so much time. Also, DFans is 100% AI friendly, meaning your account will never be banned for using AI. Unlike other platforms where a single ban can freeze assets or lose customers, DFans is safe and even welcomes creators who were banned elsewhere. Plus, unlike other platforms where support is slow or automated, DFans provides real human customer support that responds within 24 hours. They've also added a new AI analysis feature that helps you track your performance and understand what's working across your content. So if you're creating cool AI images or videos already, why not turn that into income? Check the link in the description, give DFans a try, and start monetizing your content today.
Finally, to extend the video and make it as long as you want, simply take the last image from your storyboard and use it as the starting image for the next part. From that image, generate another 3x3 grid and continue the story. You can repeat this process as many times as you want, and the character will remain consistent throughout the entire video. I hope you found this breakdown helpful. If you want to learn about three new free and unlimited AI video generator with built-in sound, watch the video showing in front of you. See you there.